Praise the Lord, everyone. My name is Dr. Teresa Bright. This is my husband, Dr. Anthony Bright. We are founders and pastors of World Night Christ Ministries. Amen. And uh, we're happy to be here again with you today to uh, teach on the anointed Holy Spirit breakthrough and faith declarations. We're actually reading the scriptures and declaring uh, the faith declarations that we would like you to say them along with us Amen. as as we confess them. You confess them with us, and your life will be blessed by making these confessions over your life. Amen. They're anointed Holy Spirit uh, confessions. So we want you to be blessed as as we're blessed, as we're saying them. We feel the presence of God and anointing it keeps increasing Multiply. as we uh, and multiplying as we can do these uh, videos. Amen. So we know that as you tune into these, you'll be blessed. Amen. Now this part today is part 17, and it's to receive faith declarations, breakthrough ones, to receive to believe and receive God's wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Amen. And these are taken from Psalm 51, verse 6. And Psalm 51, verse 6 reads, Behold, thou desirest truth in the inward parts, and in the hidden part thou shalt make me to know wisdom. Amen. Amen. And Job 36, verse 5. And why, and let my husband explain to you why we even say faith declarations, what that does for us. Amen. Job 36, verse 5, it says, Behold, God is mighty and despises not any. He is mighty in strength and wisdom. Amen. So here we see God is all-knowing, all-powerful, all-wise. He, he's the wisest. And the Holy Spirit is the Spirit of God. He's the, they're the wisest uh, people on earth. Amen. 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 Praise God, the Holy Spirit. And then um, another scripture we've taken these uh, faith declarations from is Daniel chapter 5, verse 11 to 14. Proverbs 3.13, Proverbs 4, 5 through 7, and Proverbs is the book of wisdom in the Old Testament, and James is the book of wisdom in the New Testament. Amen. And Proverbs 23, verse 4, Daniel 2, 20 to 21, and Daniel 1, 17. Amen. 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 Let's so, read Ephesians chapter 1, I think verse 17. Okay. Thank right. you, Jesus. Praise you the give Lord. Give me praise, Lord. And we're going to read Ephesians 1, 17. Yeah. Okay, Ephesians 1, 17 says that the God of our Lord Jesus Christ, Amen. the Father of glory, may give unto you the spirit of wisdom and revelation in the knowledge of Him. See, Amen. may give unto you. You have to know how to receive the spirit of wisdom. And ask for it. Amen. So that's See. why we're asking by these, by declaring, making these declarations. Amen. Amen. We have not because we ask not. Amen. You see? That's ask. what you tell me all the time. If you Thank don't ask, you, you don't receive Amen. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. What is the wisdom of God anyway? The wisdom, the wisdom of God, hallelujah, his ability, hallelujah, is given to his ch children to, to descend right from wrong. Amen. And the knowledge of God is the revelation of God, hallelujah, to unfold the truth to you so you know which way to go. And yes. the understanding of God, hallelujah, is, is, is the application of the wisdom, the knowledge, understanding, how you apply it. When you understand, you apply it. Hallelujah. Amen. The word of the Lord. Amen. Amen. The Holy Spirit, the Father God, is a giver of wisdom. Jesus is the administrator of wisdom. The Holy Spirit is the one who manifests wisdom. And you and I, as believers in Christ, we are what? Receiver of the wisdom of God. Anytime you see the wisdom of God, you all see his knowledge and understand. They go, they are triplets. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Amen. The wizards, they know and understand. They are triplet. They go together. God's infinitely wise. He's all-knowing. His understanding is unsearchable. Amen. So he wants Thank what? You, Lord Jesus. To impart to you Amen. his wisdom and know and understanding. Amen. Once Praise you are coming in agreement by using your mouth to believe in your heart, to declare boldly, so you can receive hallelujah. How do you get saved? You use your mouth. Say, Lord, save me. He saved you. How do you grow in grace and grow in wisdom of God? You ask the Lord Amen. to fill you up with the wisdom. No, understand. Say, I'm a child of God. I'm a child of God. By faith. By faith. In the living God. In the living God. I receive. I receive. Continually. Continually. The spirit of wisdom. The spirit of wisdom. Knowledge, understanding. Knowledge and understanding. And counsel and might. And counsel and might. And the fear of the Lord. And the fear of the Lord. The wisdom. The wisdom, the knowledge, the knowledge, the understanding, the understanding. God has obtained for me. God has obtained for me. I reach out to them. I reach out to them. And I receive them. And I receive them. Therefore, therefore, I'm wiser than my enemies. I'm wiser than my enemies. I'm smarter. 
I'm smarter than all the work of the devil. Than all the work of the devil. I'm wise because I'm wise. And my lips and my lips feed millions. Feed millions. The tongue of the wise. The tongue of the wise is health. Is health. My tongue brings health. My tongue brings health to me. To me. To all those who hear me. To all those who hear me. I continue to speak comfortably. I continue to speak comfortably to people. To people because the wisdom of God. Because the wisdom of God is in me. Is in me. My mouth is filled with grace. My mouth is filled with grace. Season with salt. Season with salt. That I may know how to answer everyone. That I may know how, know how to answer everyone. The wisdom of God. The wisdom of God. The knowledge of God. The knowledge of God. Understanding of God. Understanding of are God. Are all available to me. Are all available to me. I reach out. I reach out. And I appropriate. And I appropriate. The promises of God. The promises of God. Which are mine. Which are mine. Through Christ Jesus. Through Christ Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For filling me. For filling me. With the knowledge of your will. With the knowledge of your will. In all wisdom. In all wisdom. And spiritual understanding. And spiritual understanding. I continue to walk worthy of you, Lord. I'll continue to walk worthy of you, Lord. Unto all pleasing. Unto all pleasing. Being fruitful. Being fruitful. In all the best of God. In all the best of God. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Let's see Colossians chapter 1, verse 9 to 12. Okay, Anama, let's... Let's give a praise break Amen. on. Okay, you, Anna, Mama, you know, yeah, 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 with the knowledge of his will in all wisdom and spiritual understanding. See, wisdom, know your understanding. It's triplet. Amen. Okay. And verse 10, that ye might walk worthy of the Lord unto all pleasing, being fruitful in every good work. Amen. Because once you receive God's knowledge, wisdom, and understanding, you're fruitful. Amen. You have a fr a fruit comes from your life. Amen. And you're pleasing to the Lord. It says, fruitful in every good work and increasing in the knowledge of God, strengthened with all might according to his glorious power, unto all patience, and long-suffering with joyfulness. Verse 12, giving thanks unto the Father, which has made us meet be partakers of the inheritance of the saints in light. Amen. Amen. So hearing and obeying the word of the Lord causes us to be wiser, to know the things of the Spirit, Amen. and to understand the ways of the Spirit. Amen. Hallelujah. The ways of the Spirit are taught by the Holy Spirit. Yes. The will of God are taught, are revealed to us. When we submit and yield continual basis yes. to his wisdom, we become wiser. Come and give it his godly ideas, godly wisdom. That's right. And know and understand it. That's why he says, I receive a kingdom which can me move. I have grace whereby I accept God acceptably. Hallelujah. With fear and trembling. Amen. So the God of the God of grace will continue to give you his wisdom once you ask for it. And the obedience to his word. Increase our wisdom. See, when God came to Solomon, so what do you want to, me to give you? Solomon asked for wisdom. Yes, that's right. Once he get wisdom, knowledge came, understanding came, riches came. That's but right. But humility and the fellow are riches, honor, and life. So the wisdom of God, it's not worldly wisdom, it's Holy Ghost giving wisdom. And the Holy Spirit is the spirit of wisdom. It's the spirit of knowledge, it's the spirit of understanding. Once you continue to tap into the Holy Spirit, Continue to be blessed. Amen. The more you fellowship with him, mm -hmm. the more you become like him. Okay. Amen. So repeat this after me, please. Say I'm wise. I'm wise. In the Lord. In the Lord. Because I'm tapped in. Because I'm tapped in. To all wise God. To all wise God. All knowing God. All knowing God. All understanding God. All understanding God. The Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit. Is the spirit of wisdom. Is the spirit of wisdom. Knowledge and understanding. Knowledge and understanding. He's in me. He's in me. He's teaching me. He's teaching me. To walk. To walk in his infinite wisdom, in his infinite wisdom, infinite knowledge, infinite knowledge, infinite understanding, infinite understanding. Therefore, therefore, I'm blessed. I'm blessed. Going out, going out. I'm blessed. I'm blessed. In the wisdom of God, in the wisdom of God, the wisdom of God, the wisdom of the God, the knowledge of God, the knowledge of God, understanding of God, understanding of God. I continue. I continue. Increasing, increasing, and multiplying, me. and multiplying in me. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Because I'm a doer of the word. Because I'm a doer of the word. Therefore. Therefore, infinite wisdom, infinite wisdom, knowledge, understanding, knowledge, understanding, and multiplied in me, and multiplied into me, and, and imparted to me, imparted to me, Amen, Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Infinite wisdom. Okay. Father God, in the mighty name of Jesus, we just pray right now of an impartation of God's infinite wisdom, knowledge, and understanding, Amen. that none can gain, say, resist. Amen. You're blessed and prosperous and highly favored. Be blessed and increase and multiply in wisdom, knowledge, understanding. In Jesus' name, right now. Receive it. Amen.
And when you receive that, you cannot be deceived because wisdom or understanding is all truth. Amen. You say, you shall know the truth and the truth shall set you free. Amen. Amen. Excellent. God bless you. Hallelujah. Bless you, beautiful people.